Hi everyone, please do subscribe for more updates. I know that all of you are eagerly waiting for my stories. So, let us not waste our time and start the story of Guruji the saint. There lived an old saint in a village. The village was as green as a forest. Trees covered everywhere of the village. There lived an old saint in the village. People in the village and the disciples called him as Guruji. He, he was performing his duties and prayers in the ashram along with his disciples. He even built an ashram in the village and lived there with his disciples performing ashram duties and prayers. Among his disciples, one young saint named Virendar. There was a young saint named Virendar. He had a disliking for the ashram life. He secretly admired comfortable living and always dreamt of leading a rich and a happy life. He loved money. His desire for money grew enormously that he planned to get away from the ashram secretly. Virendar loved money and he wanted money more and more. His greed for money grew up day by day and he thought of a plan. One day, he saw an expensive holy book in the trunk of his Guruji. He stole the book and ran away from the ashram. He quickly wanted to sell it to a bookstall which was located in his village. He was in a hurry to dispose the book as soon as possible and make more money. So, he went to a bookstall owner and asked him how much money the book would fetch him. The owner named Hari said to Virendra to leave the book with him and come back the following day. Hari tried to remember the learned man who could help him and decided the amount to give for Virender. Hari showed the book to Guruji and asked him to value it. Guruji understood everything. Guruji understood that this book was stolen by none other than Virender and he could understand everything. Hari, the bookstall owner, offered him 20 gold coins for the book instead of 10. And Virinder wanted to change his behavior. He wept like a child and he wanted to written back the book to his Guruji. So, he quickly rushed with that book to his Guruji and wanted to return back the book to him. Virendar wept like a child in front of Guruji and asked for forgiveness and promised never to repeat such mistake. Guruji blessed Virendar 
to become a true knowledgeable saint and said that there was no better repentance to sins that repentance also expressed happiness for virender's realization virender thanked his guruji and followed the footsteps of guruji and lived happily in the ashram along with guruji and his disciples so children what did you learn from this story the moral of this story is by being nice to bad people we can turn them good so children if you dislike your siblings that is your brothers or sisters behavior talk to them and be wi- good with them always make them feel happy and be like good siblings hope you all like this story thank you